Okay guys, welcome back to your English class. Today I'm going to explain you what is the difference between present perfect and present perfect continuous. Here we go. We have two sentences here. The first one it says I've gone to school, it's present perfect, and I've have going to school, it's present perfect continuous. Okay, now present perfect, we have the sentence I have gone to school. We have a timeline now. You have past, present, future, and your stop line. Now, your sentence starts in the past. I have gone to school. Okay? And it's relevant in the present, but it is not only that person. Okay? It has happened in the past, but it finished. Okay? before your present okay now present perfect continuous i have going to school you have a timeline past present and your future now what is the difference i have been going to school it is start in the past but now nowadays it's relevant you are still doing that in the first one in present perfect simple you have done it and it finished but in this you have started but it is still happening in the present tense okay now we have the sentence i have gone to school and i've going to school what is the structure for present perfect simple subject the auxiliar have or has have for first person or has for third person the verb in past participle and the complement is a present perfect simple structure don't forget it subject have or has the verb in past participle and your complement now what about present perfect continuous? We have subject, have or has again, auxiliar being, the verb in ing, plus complement. You have I have or has been going to school. Don't forget has third person, have first person. Now we have some exercises about it. We have four sentences. Now, the idea is you need to know or you need to identify which is the correct tense. Is it present perfect simple or present perfect continuous? Now, in the first sentence we have my sister a shower for 20 minutes. The floor is wet. Now, you have the oceans. Present perfect simple. My sister has had or present perfect continuous my sister has been having okay you need to decide what is the correct is just one correct number two hi Tom I you for ages maybe present perfect simple I haven't seen you for ages or I haven't been seen you for ages okay number three Michael has learned French for three months and he loves it or Michael has been learning French for three months and he loves it. You need to choose what is the correct option. And number four, Melissa has bought or Melissa has been buying a new dress for the party. Now, I'm going to give you some time and then we're going to check what are the correct tense. Is it present perfect simple or present perfect continuous? Okay, we're going to check what are, what, are, what are the correct answers. The first one, my sister has been a shower for 20 minutes. It's present perfect continuous because you started in the past and it is still happening. 
because the floor is wet. Floor is wet in present tense. It's relevant in present. Number two. Hi, Tom. I haven't seen you for ages. Okay. It happened in past, but it stopped one day. Okay. That's why we use perfect, present perfect simple. Number three. Michael has been learning French for three months and he loves it. Why? Present perfect continuous because we have the word he loves it. Loves it, it's present. And present perfect continuous is relevant and it's still happening in your present. That's why we use present perfect continuous. And number four, Melissa has both a new dress for the party. Now, Melissa finished the action. Melissa chose her dress and she bought it. That's why we use Melissa has bought a new dress for the party. It's a finished action. You have completed. Okay. Now, please, on your notebook, you have eight sentences, and the idea is you have to select what would be the right tense. Is it present perfect simple or present perfect continuous? We had the first one. What are you doing? I've watched or I have been watched television since I arrived. Number two, do you like my living room? I have bought a new curtains or I have been putting new curtains. Number three, I'm not very well. I have been to doctors twice this week or I not very well. I have been, been to the doctors twice this week. Sorry, I'm late. How long have you sat here? How long have you been sitting here? Number three, Carol has seen this film many times. She loves it. Or Carol has been seeing this film many times and she loves it. Okay? She's a good dancer. She has won or she has been winning two championships already. Sam is not there here. He's gone. He has traveled for months or he has been traveling for months. And look at my jacket. I have had it for only three days or I have, have been having it for only three days. Check the sentences, read them. It's very important that you need to read the whole sentence and then you need to try to identify which is the correct tense. Is it present perfect simple or present perfect continuous? Okay, guys, that's all for today. Thank you so much for your attention. That's all.